what is going on everybody um like comment share subscribe i'm going to talk about my favorite comedian today louis ck yes louis ck is my favorite comedian yes um you know like i don't know i'll get to this later he came out with a new um uh, 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 special called Sincerely. I watched it. I loved it. Um, I love his comedy. Um, it's, there's a lot of self degradation and it's just, it's funny to me. Uh, he talks about it a lot. Uh, how his style of comedy is kind of like, okay, if I can crap on myself and like tell the crowd I'm an idiot and they laugh at that, then I'll keep rolling with the punches. I'll continue to tell people, Oh, look at me. I'm stupid. And he found out that that's like a really nice way for him to to kind of grasp this comedic effect with people and connect with them because we all kind of hate a little bit of things about ourselves. Like we eat too much or we litter or we're kind of ignorant a little bit. So just degrading himself kind of reflects on us degrading ourselves. It's a funny concept of comedy. I understand the route he went through. Uh, he went to uh, comedically and he, it's never stopped and he's going to continue doing it. Now he's under fire. Last year, no, three years ago, he, um, you know, consensually asked women to masturbate in front of them and they uh, refused and he said, okay. And then if they accepted, he would go ahead and do it right in their face. I think it's called voyeurism, I believe. After doing a little research, I didn't even know that was a word, but yeah, that's a word. You just like, you just like masturbate to um, like people. I don't know. It's just like a person doing sexual acts or just a person standing there. You could just masturbate to it. It's kind of weird, but you know, it is what it is. Whatever your, your kink or fetish is, you know, have at it. I don't, I don't really care. So he went under fire. He was, uh, he was kind of lobbed in with many things like the me too movement and Weinstein. And he just, he got really brutally, he got thrown under the bus, man, by a lot of people. He, uh, he was mistreated a lot because while this was going on, the Harvey Weinstein Steen thing was going on. So, like, everything was happening at the same time. So, he was kind of thrown into the fire. It's like adding – it's like you you got you have a bonfire, right? And you have, like, all the big logs to start the fire. He was, like, the little stick to maintain the fire. So, you started the fire, big logs, boom. Now, an hour in, those logs are going to run out. The fire is going to go down a little bit. So you just add a little, you know, bundle of little small sticks to keep it going. He was the bundle of small sticks. And Harvey Weinstein and all of them were the huge logs. So, you know, he just got the butt end of the stick and it sucks. But people are saying he's making, uh, you know, claims that all the sexual misconduct he made was easy or, and it was he was making light of it. Do I even have anything to say about this at this point? I mean, honestly, it doesn't even have to be Louis C.K. Literally any comedian could say anything and people would be so angry. Like Dave Chappelle, Sebastian, Sebastian at the MTV Awards literally said, like, I know you guys want safe spaces. Boom. The Internet went crazy. He said safe space. He said safe space. It's like every single thing that these comedians say is terrible to the to the media outlets. You know, Dave Chappelle literally released a uh, um, Netflix special called Sticks and Stones. That was what his special was revolved around, guys. He was trying to offend you, and you got offended. He's literally doing what he what you want to do. He is asking for you guys to do this, and you did it. I mean, how stupid can you be? These comedians at this point are just playing with you guys. They're just like, all right, fine. They want to be offended. I'm going to revolve my entire special around being offended. Anyway, tell me what you guys think. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. I love this new special. I love Louie. I stand with you, my guy. What you did was a little weird. I'm not going to lie. That That's a little weird. But, like, you know, whatever you're into, you're into. No, you didn't rape anybody. No, you didn't, you know, sexually harass anybody. No, you asked for consent. They said no. You bounced. It's that simple. And if they wanted it, then you did it. They said yes anyway. So yes means yes, I guess. Anyway, like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Peace out.